Skyler, welcome to Day Today Davis. Hello, and welcome back to another video. Exciting times today, guys. Guess what day it is? Not boat day, but snorkel day! So yesterday, we were testing out these snorkel face masks, full face masks, in the pool yesterday. And um, it was really cool. We had a fun time. And we got to practice our breathing techniques and all of that. And I feel like we're ready. I think we're ready to take it to the ocean. So we were gonna originally take the boat out to Peanut Island with the kids and let them snorkel out there. But then we decided that um, we wanted to mostly just focus on the snorkeling itself. Oh, hold on, there's a smudge here. <gasps> there you go. All right, there you go, can you see me? Okay, so we decided instead of taking the boat out, um, we wanted to focus just on snorkeling itself because with the boat, it's a whole big deal, loading it and all that other stuff. So there is a spot right across from Peanut Island where you can go to just snorkel, specifically just snorkeling and diving under this really cool bridge. And I think it's gonna be awesome. I think it's gonna be a good time. I think we did where they had the dive flags out and we were showing them, it was a class going on that day. Yes, that's where we're gonna go. And we're gonna take little Freddie. Since it's our first time, we wanna just kind of just focus on getting comfortable with snorkeling in general. Like we practiced out here in the water in our pool, but it's nothing like being out there in the actual element. So we're gonna go out there since it's our first time. Hey, being the shallow part, it's not like yeah. you're not going to no, no ocean park. We're going to like the it's inlet. Like a beachy park. Yeah. It's like a little beachy. We'll show them when we get there to, in yeah. case I'm not explaining it right. Yeah. But it's gonna be really fun. And so I'm gonna um, the jacket suit just in case you know we wanna be adventurous. And go farther. Yeah. So silly. But anyway, so yeah, for our first time, we're gonna try it out this way, and then next time we'll go out on the boat and do it that way, um, like out there, out there. No, we stop. <laughs> we'll go out there and explore the coral reef. No, next time we'll actually go to Pina Island, like cause Pina actually have like a reef on the on a little beachy side on the east side. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, where the rocks are. I think I showed them that too, but no one was snorkeling. I think they were snorkeling. There's like a bunch of rocks, and there's like really cool fish under yeah, there, yeah, and yeah. where we're going under the bridge, they have the same thing. We kind of watched a couple of YouTube videos yeah, it's of it. more of a, a beach more so than a reef, you know what I mean? Yeah. But Pina Island actually has a, a nice a reef. little shallow reef that you can go to, but we didn't want to take the boat. Plus, you can get up, but you got to pay a little charter fee. Yeah, and I, I thought about it, and I'm yeah, like, I, I don't know if I want to pay to go somewhere that I know I can drive to myself. Yeah. Like, eh, I don't know how I feel about that. But we'll see. It's the first time of many times, and I'm really excited. I got some towels right here, because we're going to get ready to go. Exciting times. No boat day. <laughs> no boat day. Take the first. On our way to Peanut Island, you guys, we just crossed over the bridge. Right here is where we took V and Mac that last time we were out on the boat, and they had all those boats out here for uh, Floatopia. That is where we were, right over there. And on this side, oh, yeah, the parking lot's that way. So on this side, when we park like right over here, there's like this bridge that we're on. You can go snorkeling underneath oh, right here, right there, right there. and over here. Do they have it blocked off so that you can snorkel? Yeah, there's the buoys out there. There's people out there in the water. Like, they can't really you see from the car, but. The bridge, so. Yeah. Like, there's people out here with their little floaties and stuff. And it's, yeah, it's people out there snorkeling. You can't really see them on camera, but they're out there snorkeling. And then, under this bridge is a really cool area to snorkel in as well. I'm not sure how deep it is out here, though. So, that's why Freddie brought the life jackets, just in case it's deeper than oh, we it's think a it nice is. Boat day. Look at Freddie. Now he regret not taking the boat. Oh. Ah. It's so, look at that, the I sun is out, time, it's clear. Every time, I tell you, every time you don't want to do the boat, it's like, you know. <laughs> Well, you know, we're just, we need to practice first. Get our feet wet. Let's figure out what it is that we're doing first. That's what I was saying, the parking lot. They See, we normally like don't this. park here. When we, um, when we go boating and stuff, we park further south than this and ride the boat up this way. But I was wondering if there was going to be parking out here. But I was like, this usually isn't that crowded on this side because it's not like a real beach. Like, it's like a, 
It's more for like snorkeling. The beach is on the other side, like further that way. So there's no parking at all? Do you have to pay for parking over here? Mm -mm. Interesting. All right, well, let's see. We can't find parking. You wanna go back and get the boat and... <laughs> Freddie upset y'all. He's like, the water's so calm. He wanna go. I don't think we can park anywhere over here, can we? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, we probably should have had to get up really early. Thank Enjoy you. your day, guys. Thank you. you. All right, guys. So we just left from uh, Peanut Island. Their parking lot was very crowded. It really wasn't a lot of places to park there. It was a, a boat day, jet ski day, snorkel day. Everybody was out there. What'd you say? Paddle boarding. Paddle boarding, Paddle -boarding. kayaking. Everything you could think to do on the water, everybody was out there doing today, and the parking lot was packed. So we weren't able to find a place to park, so we left from there, and we went to another park. Luckily, here in uh, South Florida, we have lots of beaches and water areas to go to, so we just drove just a little north of Peanut Island here to this state park, and it's a beautiful state park. We've been here before. We just never snorkeled here, but we were here before. Um, a couple vlogs back uh, I think it was in the he left me video when we went exploring the nature trails that they had out here and then in another video paradise where we actually went to the beach and it was beautiful that day oh my god the sun was out the water was crystal clear it was amazing I loved it so now we're out here and we're gonna check out the snorkeling area um, the I guess you would call them um, is it a state trooper what's the name the ranger the ranger that was here she gave us um, a map where's the map babe Fred again okay to show us where to go for the snorkeling area that they have because she said it's really nice they have like a reef like area as well here so you can see a lot of um, water I'm not water but salt life as we call it fishes and all that stuff so we're gonna get ready to head out it's a, a good walk to get there so we'll see you as we get closer I'm not sure this is the place I gave my friend to. Through the skies, the little lights. Um, you can take them off if you want to, but it's probably hot. There's rocks up ahead, so I probably wouldn't. But um, little Freddy has the map, and he was telling me what side of the ocean we were gonna be on. Guess. All you guys to guess. I'm gonna give you five seconds. The Pacific or the Atlantic? Do 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 The Atlantic! Do. Yay! The Atlantic Ocean! That is what we're going to be in today. And to get to the ocean, what I was telling you guys is that you have to go through a little bit of a walk. And this is the walk. It's like a little nature trail. No, the walk ain't even started yet. I know. This this is one part of the walk. I once you get to that bridge. <laughs> But it's a beautiful scenery as you get there. It's water on both sides. It's very relaxing. And they have, in case you don't want to walk, they do have shuttle. a shuttle that'll take you. It's like a little golf cart-like thing. And it'll take you through the bridge for free so that you can get to the beach side. So. And over here we'll see the wild jaguar. Yes. Excuse me. Did we miss it? We missed the Charlie. Oh no, it's, is it still there? Sorry guys. So we had to stop and get a flag so that we could go snorkeling. And um, there was a little Charlie out here, but I think we missed it waiting in line for the flag. Ah, we almost had a chance to take it. Check it out. We made it back out of the gift shop in time for the Charlie and the flag. That was a nice ride. Somehow my hair got sticky. Yeah. Now, so, now. we are almost 
at the the beach part where the snorkeling is we were able to get a ride on the trolley back there the one i was telling you about that kind of cuts your walk in half because you have to walk through the forest <laughs> and then you walk here and then you get to the beach once you get over these steps so that was a nice little ride up they have really cool stuff in the gift shop like all these turtles and stuff like that i thought they were really nice Oh yeah, we picked up some drinks. Freddie got some Gatorade. Get the body moving. <laughs> we had drinks in the cooler and left the cooler at home. Like, really? That's how you know we were excited. <laughs> Ooh, it's blue blue. It's really blue. It's blue and another shade of blue. It's Look at those waves though. Yeah, it's kind of rough. Yeah. Look at the waves today. This is like those surfing waves. They got people out there jet skiing. I don't know if you can see them. They're right out there. Jet skiing in the ocean. All right guys. Things did not work out um, at this particular area. Uh, we got out there and the waves, not the waves, but the water was looking really beautiful. It was really blue. And then when we got to the snorkeling side of everything, like where the rocks and stuff were, we went out there and we tried to snorkel. But as we were out there, the waves were just coming in. Like it got really brutal out there and it became really difficult to, to snorkel. And plus um, the, the rocks that we were on top of, like trying to snorkel on, they were really slippery and little Freddie was sliding on them. So. We decided that we um, we might need to go to a different park. This one where we were at, like it was like the beach. Like it wasn't like a separate secluded area for snorkeling. Kind of like how like where the bridge is that we were gonna go under, like that one was separated. So we're gonna head over to this other park. I know of another park where I know it is actually separated, it's secluded, so the waves are not hitting so hard. Um, and we're gonna try to go snorkel there and see how that works out. And plus, I don't think, um, they don't have as large of rocks on the bottom, so you're not slipping too much. It's more so like sand. So we'll try that out and see how that works. Controlled environment. Yeah. And it's not too far from here either. It's just a little north. No, it's not far. Yeah. But this was a really nice park though. I did enjoy my time here. I think you just got to and... catch it early in the morning for the waves to go to hidden. Yeah, where it's more calm. Because the waves were like, it was meant for surfing today. I mean, but it was cool. The little 15, 20 minutes later, it was really cool. I saw a lot of fish. Yeah. I, I just... Didn't you didn't see the fish, Freddy? The way, Freddy was getting taken by the waves, y'all. He yeah. was trying to survive. <laughs> uh, yeah, no. Um, yeah, it, it, mm. uh, uh, um, yeah, <laughs> we're, we're done. done. I'm done. <laughs> Forget this. We're, we're not doing this today. We drove up, and if they say lot full, I'm like, you know how big this park is for the lot to be full? This is a humongous park for them to not have no parking left it's cray cray you trying to redirect anybody to get out <laughs> omg yeah, all right we're done i'm i'm going home now i think this it's one more park though do you want to try it or no you're done uh, if it's on the way back i'll go man i'm not going out my way okay so we'll put it dang y'all i feel like we should have just took the boat shoot because with the boat we so drive the boat all the way. yeah it should just been a boat day because with the boat we don't ever deal with parking situations out here we drive the boat up here Look at me. <laughs> what happened he telling people to yeah, leave he's in. what are you doing he's telling about the time oh look y'all see him up here telling everybody to leave you see that sign right there it's a lot full look at that see it no drop off no pick up <laughs> a lot full and he's telling everybody to get out oh mg dang oh no drop off no pick up they put they must have knew it was gonna be full out here today they got all the signs out jeez man darn this is crazy this is a humongous parking lot though for it to be full like this omg what's going on was there some function going on out here today Jeez, I ain't never seen this parking lot full like that, ever. All right guys, we decided to try this whole snorkel thing one last time before heading home. I GPSed another location where we can go 
and it turns out we've actually been to this place before we just didn't know that it was, it was a, the sandbar. It's the sandbar. yeah it's, it's just, right by the sandbar the jupiter sandbar that we go to all the time by guana and if you watch our videos and you see we had the camera pointed to the side that's the location that we yeah had. where people are like swimming and all that stuff and we always take the boat here that's the thing we don't drive yeah, out here anymore here. so this is really cool i like this this is nice all right freddie so, we're gonna try it again okay it doesn't look like the waves are too bad here because it's blocked like but there's a water on both sides of the road all right huh? so based on where we parked at so we're gonna go straight out and into the water so freddie's gonna get the gopro and we will um see you guys out there on that way because i can't take the cam I'm, i don't want to risk getting the camera wet trying to go out there So now that we're done with all the snorkeling, I definitely have worked up an appetite. The rest of us are pretty hungry. So we, before we head home, are gonna stop by our favorite place, Guanabanas, and pick up some chicken quesadillas and some shrimp fritters. Kind of like the same thing we picked up when we were last here on the boat. Um, Freddie loves the shrimp fritters. And um, we're gonna I grab on those on our way home. And you love the quesadillas and chicken quesadillas. Freddie, did you have a great time today? Yeah, that was nice. Was what was, was, what was your favorite part? The part where we're about to eat. <laughs> what were you gonna say, babe? No, I was saying it was a, um, a good experience. You know? We went to three different. I mean, it uh, didn't work out today. the way we thought, but we, we now we found so many different locations to go to. Yes, and then there's even more because I googled four places, and out of the four places that I googled, we went to two of them. Look at the water. So there's two more. Yeah, you made me get the I know it is very nice today. Look at over there on that side. Yeah. Oh, we waiting for the bridge. Mm -hmm. Remember we were in the boat when the bridge came up the last time? Now we on, on top. All right, we have arrived to Guanabanas, one of our favorite places. One of your favorite places. My favorite places. Go over this way to go pick up the um, takeout. Freddie got the food. Chicken quesadillas and shrimp fritters. Oh, yes. They make me happy. Let's carry dad and see where he went to. He dropped us off out here. <sighs> Freddie couldn't yeah. wait, y'all. Hey, what about me? I'm finna get you some, Freddie. Your daddy done bust open the quesadillas. Bust the quesadillas, the mother deal. Yeah, I got extra quesadillas, Freddie. Mm -hmm. And then we also got some um, shrimp fritters. Mm -hmm. Just smiling at me, looking all pretty. Mm -hmm. I can eat shrimp fritters. Mm -hmm. That's so good. Mm -hmm. What kind of sauce is it? Mm -hmm. Good. Good sauce. That's what kind of sauce it is. Mm -hmm. ah! <laughs> Freddie smacking. <laughs> I got. I got. I got. <laughs> we can. Um, you guys, we're back home now. We stopped and picked up Skylar on our way back, and um, she was a little sad because uh, we kind of got in the water without her. So we're gonna uh, probably let her get in the pool later today. But 
today was turned out to be a really good day you know it didn't really go how we planned we didn't really get to go to the actual location we wanted but we did still get to test out our snorkel gear in the ocean with the waves and trying to see how it all works out and everything. And not only did we get the experience of snorkeling in the water, we also got to try out some new locations and different places that we had never been to or didn't really know that we had been to, so to speak. And really get to fully experience just being outside together, having a good time. Um, I really enjoyed today. Here. Definitely looking forward to the next time. And some of those spots were amazing. So, okay. Skylar's ready to go in to the pool. We're going to get in with her. Okay. We're going to end the video, Sky, okay? And then we're going to let you go get in, all right? I'm going to my room to go away right now. Okay, you want to end the video or no? Nope. Okay, I'll end it by myself. Life is a day-to-day -day experience. So enjoy. And a one, and a two, and a say goodbye ooh 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 say goodbye ooh 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 yeah thumbs up if you like this video and always be happy